Hello and welcome to the Transfer Student Diaries episode 2. So, um, this is the second episode. In the first episode, I was trying to basically get all of my um, classes and everything done and handled so that I could register, um, get all my classes registered, then apply for housing and um, get my meal plan, all that kind of stuff. But today is, I think, a day or two after I filled the, filmed the first clips for that vlog. And um, today I'm going apartment shopping i'm not doing a whole lot of stuff uh, i'm just buying a couple things here and there because um the place that i work at tj maxx is having a 20 percent off weekend for workers so basically we have a 10 percent discount but instead of a 10 percent discount we have a 20 percent discount this weekend and there's a lot of stuff on clearance and my store is partnered with home goods so there's a tj maxx and a home goods literally it's it's one big store there's a lot of good stuff there and i want to see if i can um find some things that I need. I'm not gonna buy like a whole lot of stuff, but I'm gonna try to find like a few things that I need. I think it's gonna be a fun little shopping trip. Along with that, I may be going to a sneaker store just to, um, cause they're having a sale on some of their vintage and I wanted to at least check it out, you know, see if they have anything that I would like and then where else I've got to go to Walmart also. So um, it's gonna be a fun little vlog. Uh, I was supposed to leave already, but uh, I'm still getting ready. So I'm gonna get ready really quick and then we're gonna head out. We're on the way now to pick up uh, one of my friends. So she lives right behind the store. So it's not too far. My mom said I should go to Kohl's too, uh, just to get some clothes. Cause I need some business casual type clothes. That way I can, uh, use them for like meetings and whatever like projects and all that kind of stuff that I need so I'm gonna start looking for that kind of stuff as well and then yeah I, I will just see you guys when I get there because my battery is pretty low and I don't want to waste you know battery in the car yeah, the focus. got me some shorts look at this stuff I might get this I might get that this is all my shit all my stuff I don't know if y'all can hear me, the music is loud. There's a lot of people. It's early, like we just, the store just opened like maybe an hour ago. And people, so many people hear the babies crying. Oh my God. I haven't even gone to the home goods side yet and I'm already spending a check. Like look at all of this stuff that I got to try on. So many things. I'm probably gonna put back like half of them, but hey, I mean. <laughs> All right, um, after this, I'm gonna go ahead and go back to the home good side, and hopefully I'll put most of this back because I know I don't need it, but man, I just, it's 20% weekend, man. I gotta, I gotta spend a check. Okay, Jason's Deli now. Oh, yep. Yeah. Thank you. Hey, Dad, how are you? Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. Everything good. Thank, Thank you. you. They got all that food. <laughs> right, we finished at TJ Maxx. I spent almost 100 bucks. Whatever, you're just a liar. No, I'm just, dude, it was $90. Really? Yeah. I think it was like $30. $30 here, but at TJ Maxx, I spent $90. So after this, we're going to go to Walmart, American Eagle, and then the vintage shop. Just got back from Walmart, spent another 70 bucks. Freaking red. So, yeah, I'm basically broke now. But we're going to and then we're gonna go home and then sell everything, everything that I got from Walmart. And then we're just gonna wrap it up after that. All right, we just got back from Tanger. I didn't get anything. Well, I got some ducks, but I got them to resell. So that's cool. And then they, what'd you get? Some shorts? Got right, shorts. So, yeah, I think we're pretty much done now. We might go home. Okay guys, so it is actually two weeks since the last clip that I shot for this video. Um, so as you guys know, I've been dorm shopping and I haven't really done too much shopping since then, but um, this is a portion of the video where I'm just kind of going to show you guys everything that I got of course and then um, show you kind of the stuff that I already had because I did previously go dorm shopping in 2020 when I was supposed to go there for my freshman year but I you know I have a little bit of stuff left over uh, a lot of the stuff we ended up returning but I have stuff left over plus the stuff that I'm buying now plus other stuff that I'm going to be shopping for in the future so there is going to be more shopping videos of course 
Uh, this is just the first, I guess the first of many. I, I really don't know how many I'm going to do. I'm just gonna do some until I you know, get everything that I need. But I'm gonna do a lot more shopping in the summer for sure, because that's where they're gonna have uh, a lot better deals on more of this stuff that I'm gonna need. But let me go ahead and show you guys what I have uh, right now. So, or let me first show you what I bought. What I bought was this 50 pack of hangers from Walmart. It was like $10, but I am literally out of hangers. Like I don't have any hangers for all the clothes that I have now. So I thought it would be a good idea to buy some more. That way I can take some with me, um, some empty ones in case I get more clothes and you know, all that kind of stuff. And then in this bag, I have just a little grooming kit, like a little portable one, uh, just because I feel like everything that I have uh, is just kind of shared between the house. Uh, I just wanted to get a new one, just take it with me. Uh, it was like $3, so I thought it wouldn't hurt to get it. Here I have some command hook strips. I have two packs of 12, I think. Yeah, two packs of 12, just because uh, I'm gonna need to hang things up whenever I get to my room, and I wanna hang them without damaging the walls, you know, like putting nails in the walls or thumbtacks or, you know, things like that. So that's why I got these. These are probably my favorite way to hang things up because you don't see any of the ugly, like, hole marks or, you know, like, anything like that. I think it's, like, super seamless and they look really, really good. And they're actually uh, way stronger than I thought they were. I have a couple of face towels and um, along with those I have body towels and hand towels. This is literally a bag full of towels. Uh, it's like four towels plus these little, these two little ones. And then I got this laundry basket here. I do have a laundry basket in the house already, but I wanted to get a new one because this one, I can pull the, uh, the as you can see, I'm pulling the bag off right now, but I can pull the bag off. That way I can just take the bag with me and not have to take the basket. I can just take the bag to the laundry room do that and then take the bag back instead of having to bring like the entire basket with me that's everything that i ended up buying oh besides the clothes i don't know if you guys want to see those but i'll show you anyway so um i ended up getting these shorts i think they were like 12 dollars uh these are some swim shorts and I, I usually buy swim shorts because i am very short so i wear five inch inseam shorts because they're the only shorts that look even remotely decent on me and uh, i buy swim shorts because swim shorts are usually shorter than actual shorts so I ended up buying those. Those are an extra small. Um, I thought they would be kind of tight around the waist because I'm usually either a small to medium, but the extra small had the perfect like inseam length. And so I tried it on in the store and you know, it felt fine. So I ended up getting, getting those. Uh, also got this polo long sleeve. It was like $25 plus this polo short sleeve, which was another $25. Not bad deals overall, but I'm gonna show you also all the kind of, all the stuff that I have um, currently that I already like previously had that maybe not everybody's gonna need but might be some things that people didn't really think of like this like a blender this is probably only if you like cook or make smoothies or you know like do your own cooking for most people they're probably just gonna be eating through the dining hall or eating out you know chick-fil-a or whatever but for me um, I like to you know cook and I want to get into eating healthier I mean I already am trying to actively get into it but um, in order to maintain that in college, I wanted to get this and a couple other things. Even though my kitchen is not gonna be that big, uh, just having small things here and there, I feel like is gonna help me out in saving money and you know eating healthier and all that stuff. I'm also gonna show you guys a couple other things. So back here is a bunch of stuff that my sister left uh, from when she went to college. Uh, she's already graduated, so she doesn't really need any of this stuff anymore. This is just kind of for me and my brother to take whatever we need from. And I'm probably gonna take this shower caddy I honestly had no idea she had it, but I'm gonna take that. Um, there's a couple other things back here. I don't really want to, you know, dig and sift through everything to kind of show you, but uh, just to get an idea of a couple things that are back there, you know. Plus these storage bins, uh, I feel like these are absolutely essential if you are moving to college. Buying moving boxes isn't really sustainable. I think you need to have like plastic containers that way. Um, they're not breaking down every time you're trying to move them and you then you have to buy more, you know, every time. Uh, one of them breaks and all that kind of stuff. I think plastic containers are definitely the way to go and it's way easier uh, to pack stuff into those. So yeah, plastic containers. And um, I think that's all that I can think of right now that I have. Um, I definitely have a super long list, so I will be making more shopping videos. And hopefully they'll be higher quality. I know 
Um, the first half of this video I filmed on my smaller camera, which doesn't really have the best microphone and it doesn't have the best video quality in comparison to my DSLR, which is what I'm shooting on right now. But hopefully I can kind of uh, tweak that and see if I can make some improvements on the quality of the content. And um, yeah, that's going to be about it for the video. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.